So here with Justin Henderson after that race. And Maximus. Run, and Maximus. What's up? You got, what did you think about how your dad did today? Good. Good? Good. You're satisfied with first to fourth? Mm -hmm. All right. That's it. We'll keep that in mind. <laughs> uh, you kind of stuck around the bottom for a lot of that race. Was that because of the product of the racetrack, or did you think that that corner exit speed you were generating was just what you needed to beat Brown? Very good, yeah. I felt exactly what you said the second part there. And as the race went on and went on, I was losing my entry more and more and more. And I was beginning to want to search around as I caught those lap cars. And I just chose the wrong corner to go to the top there. And Brownie's not gonna let that happen, of course. So um, I feel like we're finally, we're on the right page. These guys have been trying so hard for me and I felt comfortable and racy tonight and very happy as compared to last week. I, I mean, honestly, I couldn't even look at anybody last week. I just wanted to go home. So it was uh, a much needed change for my personal psyche. <laughs> and, uh, and I'm sure the ride home will be much more tolerable with me tomorrow. How do you utilize that momentum? I know you got Houston's tomorrow, but how do you utilize that for next week when the outlaws are here and you're on a two-day show like that? Um, it's easy, right? Like in a sprint car, I think confidence is directly tied to your testosterone. So like the worse and worse and worse you do, the lower and lower your testosterone gets. You make one good pass and it's like, oh, you make another good pass and your testosterone's coming up. You win a heat race and oh my God, you know, that's sometimes all it takes. And a little bit of confidence, one extra mile per hour on the car at the right time can make a huge difference with these things. And you know, they're meant to be driven wide open. So the closer and closer you get to wide open, the better you are. So I'm feeling confident and that makes a big difference all the way around. Did you like the track they gave you tonight? I liked it, I had fun, but it was kind of a freight train in the back from what I understand. Um, or, you know, uh, everybody was kind of on the bottom from what I understand, but I have to go back and watch the tape. And if that's the case, of course, we don't want that. But I, I liked the pro the end result that we got, that we were able to race on. And I didn't get to watch the non-wingers, but uh, I know there was a lap, last lap pass, so it must have been kind of racing. 